Breaking news from Northern Virginia. In just the past two hours, Fairfax County Police have named the young man arrested in this exclusive video. Officers say 20 year old Mecca Lee Bay crashed into a gas pump after carjacking a teenager yesterday. Now, last week, D.C. police arrested him in a different carjacking, but this time Fairfax police believe he stole $2,500 worth of merchandise from Tyson's Corner Center. And then police say he carjacked a teenager while trying to get away from officers. Our Katie Lusso got access to this surveillance video that you will only see here. Police say it started at Tyson's. A man suspected of stealing something comes running out into the parking garage, ends up carjacking a woman, takes off, and as you're about to see an exclusive surveillance footage, slams right into this gas pump. Michelle, across from Bravo Duck, he just took out to the gas station. He's on foot, head towards the building. Right there, right there, right there. The time, 4.34 p.m., a driver crashes and then bails out of a white car that police say he had carjacked just moments prior. It began inside Tyson's Corner Center. Police say they spotted a man running full speed out of the mall just moments after they'd received a call that someone had stolen items from inside and took off. Police say they started to chase after the man and watched as he pulled open the door of a moving car. He just carjacked somebody. Police say the driver dragged him for a second before putting the car in park and jumping out, which is when he jumped in and took off out of the parking garage. Jump the curb, get on Route 7. Police say they briefly chased after him, but then he pulled into the Shell gas station along Leesburg Pike and slammed into the gas pump, jumped out, and ran inside the food mart. A witness says police yelled for him to come out. We're doing surrender ritual now. Health restricted surrender ritual is happening. Moments later, he was in custody. Taking one into custody now. Subject in custody. People walking by surprised to see such damage, but shocked after seeing the surveillance footage. Oh wow, that that looks really scary actually. That is very scary. And police told us Monday night that the suspect was taken to the hospital to be treated for injuries with charges pending. In Tyson's Corner, I'm Katie Lasso, WUSA 9.